Hey everybody, Dr. Perry Bard here. And on behalf of Dr. Eric Kaplan, I wanted to send you this really super quick video to share with you some information that so many doctors have asked for. And that is in essence, a little mini crash course on laser therapy. So take out a piece of paper. I'll share some information with you, give you something to think about, and we'll dive right into it right here, right now. And I'm gonna ask you a question. How many of you, in other words, how many doctors know that LASER, believe it or not, is actually an acronym? And when I say an acronym, in other words, it stands for something. What it stands for is laser amplification by stimulated emission of radiation. That's an acronym for LASER. So if you didn't know it, don't feel bad because most doctors don't know that anyway. What you really should know is the difference in types of lasers, what a laser can do, what it can't do. And we'll start right at the very top of probably the number one question that doctors ask us all day long, which is what is better, class three or class four? And I hope you're sitting down for this one because I'm gonna tell you the answer. You ready? They're both great. The difference is the, apl the application of the laser itself. So when we're talking about class three, super crash course here, class three, as you know, non-thermal, or in other words, what is termed as a cold laser, doesn't build up heat, versus a class four laser, depth of penetration, ability to create a thermal effect, and to possibly eat, increase heat in that tissue space as well, or most likely increase heat in that tissue space. So when you talk about class three, class four, I don't care whether you have really, and there's so many different ones out there. Some are better than others, obviously, whether you have a med ray or whether you have a, uh, a micro light or whether you have a uh, MLS or a Summis, which used to be K lasers, you know, or uh, a, a light force, or uh, I mean, it can go on and on, a cutting edge. There is a humongous range of lasers out there. Some are priced great, some are priced through the roof. And the reality is I think if you learn a little bit more about what they do, what they don't do, it'll help you make an informed decision. But more importantly, we're not in the laser business. So we're here to share information with you. We're here to give you content and we're here to give you something to think about. So when it comes to basically what a laser does, let's take it back to, to, to biology 101, as you know that in essence, what we're talking about is light therapy. And what light therapy is designed to do is to increase energy. That's what light does. Light increases energy. If you don't believe it, go sit out in the sun, grab some vitamin D rays and see how you feel. We live in South Florida, so we know all about that. And I will tell you that when it comes to what a laser can do with regards to circulation. So when we talk to patients about why they need laser, we talk to them about the ability to increase circulation to that area. So what it, basically what a laser does is it increases circulation and it decreases, number one, it decreases swelling, Number two, it decreases inflammation. And number three, it increases edema in that area. So you know when an area is traumatized, in other words, if a patient suffers a traumatic insult to an area, they're going to have, as you know, damaged tissue in that area. So if you have damaged tissue or unhealthy tissue, basically you also have unhealthy cells in that area. Well, what laser does is laser does something incredible in the sense that it is designed to increase healthy cellular function. And by increasing healthy cellular function in area, what that does is that increases healthy tissue. So out with the bad, in with the good. So when you talk to patients about laser, what you wanna do is you wanna to talk to them about the keyword, the C word. The C word is, I don't know if that looked like a C. Did that look like a C? For the dyslexic ones out there. <laughs> C is about circulation. So as a result of this gentle, effective class three or class four laser, you have the ability to increase circulation in that area and you do so by affecting the cell. Now for the nerds out there, like myself, we're talking about on basically biology 101, where the light 
has the ability to increase the production of ATP, as you remember, through the mitochondria of the cell, the powerhouse of the cell, and to be able to increase energy in that area. And if you can increase energy in that area, you can increase function in that area. That's why this is so crucial, this is so vital. So when you present this, as we do in our clinics, what we do is we love to talk to patients about, in essence, a phrase that we use. A phrase that we use is basically a magnet to blood. In other words, we talk about the laser acting as a magnet to blood to increase circulation. And I think you know, doctor, also when you increase circulation, what you're doing is you're also increasing vascular and lymphatic production to help move traffic. So as you know, the laser has the ability to actually enhance circulation, move traffic, increase lymphatic drainage, and increase the ability for the patient to heal much better. Now, when we're talking about, in essence, spinal discs, and especially since so many of you know that we are in the disc business. If you take a look at Disc Centers of America, as you know, number one biggest, largest, most successful disc brand in the profession of non-surgical spinal disc centers. We always talk to patients about the ability to enhance healing for the disc. And what laser does is laser actually helps seal up some of that tissue surrounding the disc. So bottom line is that if you're in the non-surgical business and you're using spinal decompression without laser versus a doctor who's using non-surgical spinal decompression with laser, you have the ability to create a much healthier dynamic, a much more effective dynamic for the patient, and you have the potential to increase or speed up their healing, which is so incredibly powerful. One of the things I want you to think about is the simple fact that now it's a brave new world. When I say a brave new world, the simple fact that there are so many lasers now that are still kind of in the dark ages. When I say the dark ages, they're attended lasers. What if I told you that there is, believe it or not, a class four laser out there that's unattended, that is price pointed unbelievable. And if I didn't have such a great response to it when I damaged my foot, I broke a bone in my foot, I put this laser on it, nothing helped me except this laser. We're not in the laser business, but if you want to reach out, I'll share with you what it was, how it helped me. And, uh, and the price was ridiculously low, which is incredible. Uh, but so effective. It's not about price. It's really about efficacy. It's about results. But this one outperformed all the others. And I thought that was pretty incredible. So I'll share our information with you, contact information, somewhere, somewhere here on the screen. The simple fact is this, that if you are using laser, you are considered more of a high-tech office. And that is a powerful thing, especially with regards to the presentation and the packaging of laser. Now in our world, what we do is we present laser in a package. So you have a choice, one of two things. In other words, if you are in the disc business and you're doing cash-based packages, which is what we educate on, teach on, show, give examples and, and, uh, and more, then you have the ability to include that in your package. But let's say somebody comes in with a shoulder problem or a knee problem or an elbow problem, or you just want to package laser in and of itself, by itself, separately and distinctly, then our highest recommendation would be to do exactly what we do in the disc business, which is to draft it in a financial, show how many patient visits the patient is being prescribed, not recommended, did you catch that? Prescribe, use the right verbiage, use the medical verbiage, because if you're gonna use medical technology, then get out of the salesman game and get more into being a doctor. So if you're gonna present it, present it the right way, show it in black and white, in terms of what you're prepared to prescribe to the patient, how many visits the patient needs, the cost per visit, if there are any prepay enhancements or discounts that you're including, but put that in a patient folder. And if you put it in a patient folder, it'll look better, it'll be more professional. And I promise you the conversion rate with regards to patients saying, wow, this is the doctor I wanna see, much more professional, much more effective, much more powerful, 
And also in the package, don't forget to include what we include, which is research on laser, which is in essence a biography about you, your CV, what we call in essence your health pass. Talk about your clinic. Talk about the Q&A. What we also include in the package is a Q&A which, with regards to the five, six most common questions that patients have regarding laser because remember if you educate the patient properly the patient will go back to their husband wife significant other and they're going to simply say to them honey this is what we spent this is why i needed it this is what the doctor prescribed and this is what we can expect and i think that is a realistic goal remember doing two things under promising and what over delivering if you want to learn more about how to present how to educate how to conjoin multiple treatments, how to conjoin multiple technologies, then the highest recommendation I can give you without any shadow of a doubt is try to grab a seat at the most popular training that we give, which is known as the Cairo event. You can go to the website. Hopefully I can put a website here somewhere on this page for you. Um, if you go to the website and there are seats available, try to grab a seat at the upcoming training. We will answer more questions about laser. We'll show you actually our marketing for laser, which is so important. You can conjoin laser for other things, other packages, or you can hold it out separately and distinctly. If you are treating back pain, leg pain, neck pain, joint pain, radiculopathy, sciatica, and so much more, if you have the ability to have a great laser, and you know how to apply it at the right place in the right time based upon medical necessity, you can enhance healing. This is always, always, always about better patient results. This is what we teach at the Cairo event. It is the number one training for doctors that understand that chiropractic is a service and it is also a business. Much like any other healthcare provider, whether you're a dentist, a podiatrist, an internal medicine specialist, an orthopedic surgeon, a neurologist, a neurosurgeon, a, a pain management spe specialist, uh, a physiatrist, there are always two hands. The, as you know, the business hand, the serving hand, the two hands come together. You'll learn more about that at www.thecairoevent.com. Do your best to try to grab a seat. Your mind will be blown. You'll come away with so many gifts, and uh, I guarantee you'd love it if you're able to grab a seat. All of them sell out. Go to the website right now, www.thecairoevent.com. See if you can grab one. You'll learn a lot more about what you could be doing, should be doing, want to be doing, and need to be doing when you go back to your office on Monday to enhance your patient value, to enhance the prestige of your practice, to enhance your confidence level to know that you are in the right place at the right time. If you're the right doctor with the right training and the right technology, we teach that at the Cairo event and so much more. It's the most fun thing I'll tell you that we've ever done. And uh, we hope to see you there on behalf of Dr. Eric Kaplan, who's been in my life, by the way, for 34 years. Did you know that? Yeah, this is actually going into our 35th year together. The relationship that every chiropractor dreams of, and we go into it at the Cairo event and so much more. Thanks so much for watching. We can't thank you enough. Raise your game, better package, use the best laser that you can at the best price. No question about it. There are better ones out there. I promise you, unattended class four, crazy good. Make it awesome for your patients. Can't wait to see you at the Cairo event.